Daniel 2.28b begins with this introductory phrase that gets us up to the Zakaf Katon, the first verb we've seen enough immediately to recognize Yod Dalet Ayin. This is the Hafel perfect third person masculine singular. And here we have a Lamed preposition. This is having the function of direct object marker. So he caused to know the king Nebuchadnezzar. So the he, of course, has been the God in the heavens from the first part of the verse. And this is interesting because, of course, Daniel is the means by which God is revealing the dream and its interpretation to Nebuchadnezzar. And that actually hasn't happened yet. This is an introduction. But this way of talking indicates this is a means of revealing to Nebuchadnezzar using Daniel. Okay, next up, we have an expression here, something like that which, preserving the relative clause kind of idea. And then here we have the hey vav hey verb in its imperfect third masculine singular form. And then we have in the latter days expression leading up to the atna. And this in the latter days expression actually appears in the Hebrew of Daniel in Daniel 10, 14 also, where it says, Ba'acharit hayamim. So the same kind of idea, abate preposition, and it's determined state ending in the latter days. So all together, we have, he caused the king, Nebuchadnezzar, to know that which will be in the latter days.